Hello and welcome back to Excel Learning Series with Sayed. In today's episode, I am going to show you Autofill, a very cool feature of Excel that will allow you to enter data automatically without having you to enter it manually on the worksheet. There are several things that you can enter automatically inside Excel. For example, we can enter a series of numbers. If I enter one and drag this down using the drag handle, it is going to fill in the same number for me. But in case if I just click on that little handle, which is autofill options. Now select fill series. See that Excel understands that I need the series of numbers and it will fill that up for me. Let me get rid of this one. Now I will try this one more time, but this time I will hold the control button on the keyboard and drag it using the drag handle. You can see Excel filled in the series for me. Similarly, I can also enter the days. For example, I can enter Monday. And if I simply drag this down, Excel will fill the series for me. See that? The, 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 the short form of Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, so on till Sunday. But what if, if I start, you know, if I continue to drag this further, it will start over from Monday again. Similarly, if I use the full form of the same word Monday and drag this, Excel will smartly fill that up for me again. I can go on and repeat this. Now let me try another thing. There is month name that I can try with Jan. If I simply enter a three letter uh, name for a month and drag this down, Excel will fill in the three letter month name for me. And it went up to December. What if, if I keep dragging this further? It will start over from Jan. Isn't it great? Now let me try another thing. What if, if I enter time? Will that work? Let's see. I will enter 9 am and I would enter 9.30. Select both of them and drag this down. There is a pattern. There is a difference of 30 minutes. So Excel will remember that and smartly fill all the data for me on the cells that I drag it down to. There is a difference of 30 minutes. See that? Now what if I, if I do not enter that 30 minutes difference? Let's see what happens. I will simply drag this down and you can see Excel will jump for one hour. There is a difference of one hour between each jump. That's the default thing that Excel does for us. Now what if I want to enter some custom list? For example, I say product one and I drag this down. See that? Excel smartly fills in the data for me, product one, two, three, so on. Similarly, if I press, say, if I enter text one, and if you don't want this thing to go into series, you can simply select the autofill options before you do any other operation inside Excel and select copy cells. It will simply copy the same text over and over again into all other cells you drag it down to. You can keep exploring autofill options for your own use and make it yours. There are many things that you can do in autofill. I hope you enjoyed this video and you find it useful to perform your day-to-day -day operations using Excel. Thank you for watching. Do come back and subscribe for more. Have a nice day.